Hello guys, this is Rich Rich TV and welcome back to my channel. But if we're start the devotional guys, I would like to shout out the following person on channel. Napunta rito at join sa devotional. Shout out and God bless to IV Blog, Francis Laiko, Carl on channel, Dianas TV, SSC TV of Korea, Juna Salundaga, Heart Ponsalan, Retro Blog, Connie Blog, Connie Love, Michael Aborita, Mabel Ducosin, Barashel Imbudo, Nempa Amutin, Gritz Figueroa, 24-7, Ping Bertolpo, Pamilya Lagan Channel, and even to those who did not join us during the premiere, but still, napunta pa rin dito para manood at makinig sa devotional. God bless us all, guys. TV Hello guys, how did we apply the test? Yung mga test na dapatin sa buhay natin. Did we answer it or God answered it? No? Kaya, ano, lapit talaga ka tayo kay Lord, no? Palaban tayo kay Lord. Kasi sa yung ano natin, Savior natin, no? Uh, kung may testing man, hindi natin kaya, let's ask wisdom from God. And I know, God would really grant us the desires of our heart. Kasi malakas tayo kay Lord, no? I guess it's not for si Tardy Bosch now. Let's open our Bible to Romans chapter 1 verses 1 to 6. Still guys, I'm using the devotional study Bible because the word choose is so simplified na. Maintindihan talaga natin. Okay, so the word of the Lord in Romans chapter 1 verses 1 to 6 says, Paul, a servant of Jesus Christ, called to be an apostle, and set apart for the gospel of God, the gospel he promised beforehand to his prophets in the Holy Scriptures regarding his son, who as his human nature was a descendant of David, and who through the spirit of holiness was declared with the power to be the son of God. By his resurrection from the dead, Jesus Christ our Lord, through him and for his name's sake, we receive grace and apostleship to call people from among all the Gentiles to the obedience that comes from faith. And you also among those who are called to belong to Jesus Christ. Amen and Amen. I guess let's not pray. Father God, many times you call us. But instead, O oh Lord, we also dishonor the calling. We feel as if the calling is too difficult for us to do. But yet, your Holy Spirit is also working in us, helping us to do things sa mga pinapagawa mo sa amin. Lord, even as you call us, O oh God, guide us, lead us, manifest in us kung ano ang dapat namin gagawin. Sa buhay namin, at tumutulong kami sa mga member ng pamilya namin, and even to those people around us, Lord. Give us wisdom on how to do all these things para mapadali ang mga trabaho na pinapagawa mo sa amin. Oh God. With you, O oh God, nothing is difficult because it was you who guide us and lead us on things to do, O oh God. Yes, Lord, we commit all these things to you. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen and Amen. Okay, guys, so our focus verse for, the, for this evening is found in Genesis, uh, no, Romans 1, 1. And it says, Paul, a servant of Christ Jesus, called to be an apostle and set apart for the gospel of God. So the title of our devotional for this evening, guys, is Set Apart. The three world taxes of Sri Lanka known as Tok Toks. Siguro ito yung mga ano, yung uh, tricycle sa atin, no? Are convenient and delightful, made, uh, delightful mode of transport for many. Lorraine, a resident of the capital of Colombo, also realized that there a mission field. Hopping and to a talk 
talk one day, she found the friendly driver more than happy to engage in conversation about religion. The next time she told herself, she would talk to a driver about the good news. The book of Romans starts with Paul declaring himself as set apart for the gospel of God in Romans 1.1. The Greek word for the gospel is evangelion, which means good news. Paul was essentially saying that his main purpose was to tell God's good news. What is the good news? Romans 1.3 says that the gospel of God is regarding his son. Tuwa ka ba? Malapit na Christmas, guys. It talks more about Jesus Christ. No? Malapit na ang Christmas. The good news is Jesus. It's God. I want to tell the world that Jesus came to save us from sin and death. And He's chosen us to be His mode of communication. What a humbling fact. Sharing the good news is a privilege all believers in Jesus have been given. We receive grace to local others to the faith in verses 5 to 6. God has set us apart to carry the exciting news of the gospel to those around us, whether on talk, talks, or wherever we are. May we, like Lorraine, look for opportunities in our daily life to tell others the good news that is Jesus. So guys, alam niyo naman siguro kung saan ako ano, nagsishare ng word niyo. Other than Facebook, I also shared uh, the word, God's word about Jesus to my students in school and even to my colleagues sometimes. So, yung mga taong pinapadala ni Lord uh, sa akin. Kaya guys, we really need to ano, to share God's word. We are set apart to be holy. No? So, si Lorraine, grabe, no? Nasa tricycle. Kasi may bagong, ano, di ba? Tricycle na isang gulong sa harapan, dalawa sa likod. Yun yung, ano, tok-tok uh, sa kanila sa Sri Lanka, no? So, yes, may mga, ano, din sa atin dito sa bus na nagsishare ng word, no? Hindi sila nahihiya. So, mag-share ng word. So, grabe yung boldness nila. Sana ganun din tayo. Kaya lang minsan nilalait natin yung mga nagsishare ng word, no? Uh, ano lang, let's just listen to the word na sinishare nila kasi yun yung conviction nila na mag-share ng word ni Lord. So, whenever they ask, let's give them. Ako na bibigay talaga ako ng mga ganyan. Let's also discern ko ano yung uh, mga words niya pero pag may mga words na hindi naman magaganda, then let's ano, disobey it, no? Let's Bakit lang tayo, pwede naman ting salain yung mga ano eh, mga words na naririnig natin ko. Ano yung maganda, yun yung i-apply natin sa sarili natin. If they are something for us, well, it's up for us to share. Pero mas maganda talaga pag mag-share tayo. No? God would bless you for that. Because what they did is grabe yung boldness. Si Lorraine, grabe din yung boldness niya. No? Kaya set apart siya talaga. Set apart to be holy by God. I guess as I proceed to the two question, what barriers do you experience in sharing your faith? <laughs> Minsan, the character of people around me na nasisiran ko, parang uh, they do not listen well. I do not know, guys. <laughs> if you are listening there, <laughs> no, sa ano, sa seriously listening to the way na sinisir ko, mag-heart nga kayo dyan, heart ng tatlo, send ng heart ng tatlo, para malaman ko kung sino yung seriously listening to this, what I'm sharing to you. Kasi guys, pinipray ko kayo, no? pinipray ko kayo. Bago kayo pumunta rito, I, I pray for it. And then, kaya sabi ko, you are a blessing, no? Because I prayed for you before you came. Ang dami-dami ko kayong pinipray na andito. Yung iba, hindi na pupunta rito, no? Pero sige lang, uh, pray pa rin ako sa, sa kanila. Pero I prayed more of you than to those na hindi na pupunta rito. Kasi nga, uh, spend time to those who are willing to hear than to those who are not. Baka i-drop off ko na sa prayer ko sila. No? 
I seldom pray for them, pero seldom lang ha. Pero yung regular na pumunta rito is really being prayed for seriously. Second question, what talents or interests can you use to present the good news? Dito kasi God gave me the talent of sharing, no? Uh, groups, churches, organizations, schools are inviting me sometimes to so, to speak. So, ano, uh, forte ko na talaga yung ano, magiging speaker, no? Nakaabot nga po ng, ano, ng Germany na naging speaker lang, no? At kung saan-saan dito sa Pilipinas, just to speak. O baka gusto niya rin ako imbitahin. <laughs> it would be a great part of me and I would be happy for that. No? I guess let's now proceed uh, to our prayer. <clears throat> Jesus, thank you for making us your mouthpiece for your goodness. May your spirit give us the courage and love. To share about you today and every day of our life. Yes, Lord, thank you for the blessing. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen and amen. Yes, guys. See you again tomorrow. God bless us all because I know God will bless us 10 times better. This again is Rich TV. Kita kita time ulit. Tengah sembli. Ba'alan.